very happy to be with you today. It's been a great journey joining Cisco over the last two years. So funny enough, I started at the pandemic right in Feb of last year. So I've experienced the whole journey, but it's uh, my remit in Cisco. I'm responsible for our business in Middle East and Africa. It's uh, 72 countries across three continents, uh, 2,000 uh, currencies, two calendars, and a great team that uh, is try trying to drive digital transformation across the region. It is clear that technology and innovation is the name of the game now for, for post-pandemic, and now there is everybody's racing for digital transformation. So if you look at what Gartner released about a spend in ICT technology, 170 billion, with a growth of 4.5% year over year. So this is giving you an indication that there is a great appetite and drive in the region to drive digital transformation. At Cisco, we're at the heart of this. So we are leading through technology and innovation to drive an inclusive future for all. And the arm that Cisco uses in country is a program called Country Digital Acceleration. So we work with governments, enterprises, SMBs, entrepreneurs to try to drive new innovation and technology in the region. And this is across all segments. So if you think of healthcare and all the digital transformation that's happening with telemedicine, great examples in the UAE with Saha and, and Medcare and how we, 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 we ex change the experience to become a hybrid experience, remote, whether it's patient relationship, physicians, uh, if you look at uh, education, all the distance learning and education, the future university, uh, future classroom, university in the UAE, university and all this new use of AI and machine learning and customer sentiment to helping students with attendance, with uh, innovation, with um, um, automated uh, notes taking, big innovation education, e-learning. This is the same in Egypt with the Ministry of Education, with Umm Qura University in Saudi, great innovation in education. If I look into government services, all the government services, whether it's licenses, whether it's connected justice, lots of initiatives that are happening in the region to, uh, to le leveraging um, digital transformation, oil and gas, uh, government services. So the list is long and our countries and our governments are racing and they have a big appetite for digital transformation. We're lucky to be living in an emerging market where there is a great op opportunity and potentiality for, for growth and uh, digital transformation with lots of challenges, but more so opportunities and a great return. The 12 months were hectic and filled with achievements. So the first one, since we are in the UAE uh, celebrating Expo 2020, Cisco is the official digital network partner of uh, Expo 2020. So Cisco's network is the backbone of Expo 2020. There's an implementation of over 30 technologies that are at play today in Expo 2020. So whether in 10 based networking, where you have an automated network that learns, adapts, um, um, you, with the use of AI and machine learning to run such a big event and big operation and enhancing the user experience and, and, and making it safe, cybersecurity. We have Cisco umbrella implementation end to end to make sure that our users are having a safe experience whether it's um, 5G or Wi-Fi 6, high speed to be able to enjoy the experience with immersive technologies, virtual reality, uh, QR coding. So to tell you an example, so 5G, the speed is 20 gigabits per second versus 4G, one gigabit per second. So you're experiencing tremendous speed, whether it's physical security, all the CCTV and uh, building management systems to make sure that everybody's safe, whether it's digital signage to tell everybody where to go. So whether collaboration and, and uh, the, the remote work and making it also as an inclusive experience for those who couldn't make it to Expo, that they can enjoy the experience. So definitely Expo 2020 is a big, big achievement for Cisco over the last 12 months in healthcare. We've had a lot of initiatives through our uh, CDA project, Country Digital Acceleration with Saha, with Medcare for telemedicine, and really having um, uh, solutions to, uh, to safeguard the patient and the physician uh, safety, health and safety throughout this by guiding, wayfinding for a patient throughout the hospital system, by doing examination remote and, and uh, setting the patients with the specialists in education. All the remote learning, all the universities, all the schools are leveraging now Cisco um, uh, learning uh, platform where you can do e-examination, where you can have good engagement between teachers and students, where you can do um, 
AI um, uh, note taking where you do robotics in this. So, um, so, so, so the list is long into the achievements. And maybe one of the things I'm very proud of being here in the UAE is the UAE National Coders Initiative that Cisco is a great partner of. And the aspiration is talent to drive talent and to drive development in STEM. And the aspiration is to have over 100,000 coders and developers by, uh, by 2030 and a, a, a thousand uh, digital um, um, companies due to that. So a lot is happening and we're very proud to be part of that. And not just the UAE and Saudi, big mega projects that we're working on, whether it's Gideya, Red Sea, Neom, uh, in Egypt, uh, the nuclear plants and the smart city, uh, administrative capital, all the new universities and knowledge city in, uh, in Turkey, new airports are being built in South Africa, lots of advancements in fintech and banking. So uh, Qatar World Cup that's coming up in uh, 2022. So Cisco is the, the, the partner and we're running and connecting nine stadiums and it's fully connected and we have a digital twin so the achievements over the last 12 months has been really tremendous. And the whole, the whole message here is that technology and innovation in, is the enabler to have an inclusive future for all, where we can leverage technology for the prosperity and the well-being of the region. And that's Cisco's vision, an inclusive future for all. Technology and innovation. So as some of the examples, the big focus is on hybrid work and remote work and remote learning. Everybody is trying to figure out the right formula in this and Cisco has the right solution in place for collaboration. So whether it's in the classroom, whether it's in, with governments, whether it's uh, learning. So for example, one of the latest innovations that are coming out is the holograms. So how we can um, transform the collaboration experience to have to be much human, to, to, to give you the sense that you're really seeing the speaker and you're engaging. So the hologram technology where you can really project the speaker, where you can have the teacher speaking, where you have the government official addressing the nation, it's a totally different uh, and transformative experience and immersive uh, reality, um, um, virtual, virtual reality, AI. So, uh, so that's a big focus, smart cities. Expo is a small example of how a smart city and intelligent city should be where everything is automated and you use AI and machine learning to drive automation and security and, and uh, transport, logistics, uh, lighting, uh, everything in a smart city through the use of AI and, and uh, hi um, hybrid clouds and multi-clouds and leveraging the number of clouds to be able to do that. So definitely the new innovation is AI and machine learning the use of clouds, and we've seen that with, uh, with um, COVID, the, the adoption uh, of cloud has um, accelerated because we've seen uh, in the last year, it has accelerated all the growth. So it's interesting, IDC had a study with all the top CIOs, and they said post COVID, COVID had accelerated the digital transformation in all enterprises with over a year. To where we are. So definitely we're in great times where innovation and technology is driving the livelihood of our governments, our citizens, our enterprises and our own experience as, 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 um, as users.